Welcome to beginner friendly step by step candle making. Today I'm going to show you guys how I made these candles. So I got these candles from Craft Z um, off of Amazon. We'll get into that later. In this candle making kit, I received soy wax and usually candles are mostly made with waxes such as beeswax, soy wax, palm wax, gels, and synthesized wax um, are usually um, made and used in candle making. I wanted to show you guys how the soy wax looks up closely and it's definitely a soft wax in my opinion and it definitely melts uh, faster than beeswax. Just holding the wax in my hand, it melted from my hand warmth. One thermometer comes in the box and then four candle tins come in the box as well. It's a square one and then a round one. And then after I have four bow tie clips, this is definitely useful in the candle making. This is to help the candle wick to stand up while solidifying. I have got four stirring sticks and then four wicks, four warning labels, and then also four glue dots. That's basically to keep the uh, candle wick in place. And then of course the candle making instructions. Gotten four fragrance oils. And actually these oils smelled so pleasant and so good like oh my gosh it was so refreshing um, next I received four dye chips and then a pouring pot this is what keeps the wax in and warm so I'm using a electric countertop and then um, a pot and then I poured one cup of water in the pot and then place the pouring pot on top of the water it's basically like a bain marie and or you can call it a water bath i next poured the whole eight ounces of soy wax in there but for one candle it basically overflowed so i definitely um, learned my lesson with the first candle so I didn't uh, put so much in after the other candles, but now I am going to use one of the glue dots in there and then I'm going to put the candle uh, wick in on top of the glue dot after. And when I tell you guys, please use a tweezer if you have longer nails than mine or even nail length as mine were because it was so hard and it was definitely a struggle trying to get that thing off. I believe that the soy wax melted pretty easily. Um, I did use a stir stick to move it a little bit to melt it faster. After I put one of the green dye chips in there and then I used the stir stick to stir the dye up in the soy wax. And then after I did that, I used the coconut lime. You guys, this smelled so good and it smelled my whole house up. Definitely smells amazing. And I kept stirring and the more I stirred the more the fragrance got stronger and stronger and it just smelled so good after stirring everything together I poured everything in the tin can and let the candle solidify you guys I believe candle making is the most easiest thing I have made also, how are you guys liking this setup? I just wanted to ask because I love the way it looks on camera. But now I am done and the candles are done solidifying. So next I'm going to cut the wicks. I went under the stick and then I cut it off and just threw the excess parts away. And then after I just put the warning label on the candle. Also, I don't know what happened right there. It wasn't like the candle was moving. I don't know it's my first time making candles so I think I did a good job anyway I believe this candle making kit is beginner friendly and it's easy they literally have the instructions that walk you step by step if you need help me personally I didn't need it I felt like it was common sense but then also I've been formulating for years so this is kind of normal to me <laughs> so everything that was in the instructions was like duh I know 
Um, but if you're definitely looking into starting a business and or learning how to make candles, I believe this candle kit is definitely um, helpful and um, is a start to some type of journey that you might um, proceed with. They have four bags of soy wax, which is eight ounces for each bag. And I only used two bags and then like a half or like a third of the other bag. I am now showing you guys where I got my candle making kit. I actually got it right on Amazon. I had it on Prime um, and got it in like two days. It's $39.99. It's called craft and you can literally search up craft well actually I'll have the link in my description box so you can just click on it and go straight to it um, but I just wanted to show you guys the price difference because you can also search up craftz.com and they have their own website of so much stuff I mean bath bombs making bath bombs like bath bomb kits um, they have candle um, dye um, blocks if you need them uh, candle making kits for like bigger candle making kits but this one can't this DIY candle making kit is the same thing literally the same thing on Amazon but it's $62 I'm literally helping you guys save some money um, yeah that's what they have soap making um, I'm literally helping you guys save money I mean if you want to go through the business I don't really think you should personally because I just think it's saving money and literally they have a whole sale right now um, but yeah I just wanted to show you guys the things I was literally like wow bath bombs bomb making actually um, if you guys would like I would love to record a video showing you guys how I make bath bombs and other things I know there's certain products and um, formulations that you guys would like me to formulate and I am definitely excited to make um, I've been pre-recording like crazy um, so those videos are coming those videos are actually getting edited out right now but yeah thank you all for watching this video thank you for supporting me I'm so thankful for you guys I, I don't think you guys understand how thankful I am of your support the ones that go to natural nay formulations and or natural nay to support um, it really means a lot thank you all have a nice day see you till next time bye